Assalamu alaikum. Today is Tuesday, one of my lecture days. I am on my way to school and I thought to show you how I plan my lectures with Salat. To be honest, it is not always so easy and smooth, but we would continue to strive and plan our times anyways. Salat should always be in our minds. So now I am at the bus stop waiting for my bus and it's going to take about 20 minutes before the bus arrives. Oh, it's freaking cold outside and hmm, I am not so cold today actually because I have padded myself very well. I used to come outside in my Niger dress, like my Niger, my Niger dressing styles before I learned my lesson the hard way. <laughs> so now I had to wrap myself like shawarma. Seriously, if you are in this country, you need to learn and unlearn to wrap yourself like shawarma. So I am still waiting for the bus and yeah. hopefully it comes soon. Okay, now I am in the bus. The bus have arrived and I am paying to get my ticket and I will go have my seats. And so, yes, this is after 20 minutes. So I stayed 20 minutes waiting for the bus. Like, So I was not so cold because, you know, hmm, I have padded myself very well. All right, so now... I am now in school and this is the Cohen building where I have, you know, one of my lectures. And so, I am, yes, I am about 10 to 15 minutes early. <laughs> clap for me. <laughs> if you know me very well, you will clap for me right now. <laughs> so, I'm trying to, like, locate the classroom for the lecture. Mm, me, eh? I have frequent this place, so this is not my first time coming to this lecture venue but ah <laughs> i am not so like conversant with the building and in fact if i did not frequent a place like three to five times i can still lost <laughs> let me just put it that way <laughs> so let me know in the comment section if you're like me but i am very very quick to recognize someone like if i see you once and if I have seen you once and I have had encounter with you, if I see you in another five years, then I would know you. So that is me. But road, <laughs> I can lost it. Eh? <laughs> so this is me trying to figure out the classroom. I'm trying to remember, trying to check the um, the wall for directions, and you know, so something that will just help me to get to the lecture venue without many hassles, you know. So, yes, I'm still trying to figure it out. I'm trying to check, okay, because I'll be going to seminar room A. So I'm busy checking the arrows and, you know, I don't want to, I don't want to be walking up and down. So I want to be sure. So I'll be going back and yes, I'm almost there. And now I was thinking this was the classroom and I was like, no, this doesn't look like it. So let me go forward again. <laughs> so that was how. I was able to get the classroom. Hey, and first time in history, I'm earlier than the lecturer. Oh yeah, you people should start giving me a colleague. Start clapping, start clapping, because hmm, today I am earlier than the lecturer. <laughs> so the lecturer is here now, and I will be going into the class firstly to tap my card so that I will be marked present. Otherwise, you will be marked absent. And so I am going to have my seat and enjoy my lecture. Dimension of historical inquiry can make some people uncomfortable. Surely we can't treat Adolf Hitler or Joseph Stalin or Mao Zedong. The first class is over and I am heading straight to the masjid. Um, yes, that is how you just do it. You just try to use any free time. Else, you'll be, you'll be margin salat. Like, you'll be missing a lot of salat and that is not nice at all. So, this is the university mosque. If you're not careful, you wouldn't know this is a mosque because there was nothing to even identify that it is a mosque. There was no, um, signpost or anything. Like, the first time I came here, I was just going up and down trying to figure out where the masjid is not knowing i was at the front look at your girl or your village girl how was i supposed to <laughs> how was i supposed to get in with my card when i had turned my card upside down <laughs> god 
So someone came outside to rescue me. The person opened the door. Like you cannot have access to the masjid if you have not registered your card. And maybe for security reasons, I don't know, but you can't just come into the masjid if you're not a student. So you have to have your card. Otherwise, maybe someone will open the door for you from inside. So do you think our religious places in Nigeria also need this like to be able to cope those who can have access into our worship places like our churches and our mosque like because of the insecurity challenges that we are facing now in nigeria so anyway um i'm just trying to show you what the masjid looked like i just left the um, ablution session for for women i think this is for the men Yes, that is for the males and them. So I'm trying to like just read some announcements on the wall and just to get what is going on. And so I will be going into this room now and this is where I am going to be praying. Yes, this is the session for prayers for females during like oh, outside Juma, Juma time. Yeah, So... I'm just trying to get myself prepared for salat and yeah so another thing you can just do to help yourself is to make sure your muslim pro app is functional if you're in the uk or anywhere in europe because you wouldn't hear i done from our mass from the masjids here i don't know why it's like that it's very sad but i think it's just like that because we don't hear any sounds from the churches too so that is how you can get to know do, um, the time for solat and yes that you can plan yourself better so now i am through with solat and i am heading straight outside to the i'm just i'll be going to get my shoes first then i'll be going to the library to like continue with the assignment that is making all of us run kitty kitty kata kata right now <laughs> Oh my god. Yes, so this is me going to the library and trying to see what I can get my hands on before the next class. Subhanallah. The next class is by 4 p.m. and look at how everything is dark already. So this uh the constitutional evolution of the colonies of the United States. We are looking at the case study of Egypt and the Suez Canal in North Africa. I'll be focusing on and have to think about, reflect on the select occurs an unfortunate afternoon in fact a couple of afternoons and change and unfortunately uh, the other groups met in one seminar uh, room A I think one hour later I was through with the class and look at how everywhere is dark just 5 p.m. like it's literally night right now and Salat, Salat Ulama grip came in when I was in class just immediately I entered class so around like um, 4 like 4 p.m. Salat Ulama grip came in and I was like hey when did I finish praying as we save hey Nigeria, my country, I love you. We can plan our time very well. like Because the weather is most likely very predictable. This is just to five. Like about two minutes to five or something. And everywhere is this, everywhere is dark. So I'm just waiting for my boss now. As soon as the boss comes, like the boss is going to take about 20 minutes or thereabouts before before it arrives and oh my god i'm going to stay inside this cold again for about 20 minutes hmm. and just before stepping into the class we are about to step into the class when the adan for maghrib came in i was like what i just left the masjid i just prayed asri and maghrib came in I was just step I did the class and I came out. So I was planning to go to the masjid again for Maghrib and someone told me that it's likely they have closed that they will close after Maghrib because I had missed the Maghrib or so and I don't it's like they closed the masjid after Maghrib and I was not so certain. I was just like, hmm, let me rush down home if probably we in a lot I will get home before Ishai comes in. But I'm telling you, Ishai would come in anytime from now. By 10 minutes past 5, Ishai would come in.
so it's like the salads everything is just jam packed we did a very short space like we did a very short time the solar time is now very the proximity is now very close and hmm, if you're not careful you're going to be missing solar you're going to be combining solar and it's not meant to be hey Nella, have mercy on us so i'm just going to wait for the bus now and ah uh, i'll be going home it's been a long stressful day it's been a long day hmm. Nella is our face and make everything May Allah is our first and crown our efforts with success. Okay, bye bye.